Hi everyone, welcome back. Today I'm going to be starting a game called Close to the Sun. This is a game, I've already played it once, but it's been a couple of years and I honestly don't remember a whole lot about it. Um, all I remember is it's about a woman in like the early, late 1800s, early 1900s. Uh, she goes looking for her sister who is aboard a ship called the Helios that was built by Nikola Tesla. And it's a bit of a horror game. And the only segment that I remember of this game is there's a portion, I think, halfway through where you have to be outrun some monsters. And it's a very, very precise run. Like, you got to do everything just perfect or you die. Um, that took me a very long time, very several tries to get through that. But that's all I remember of this game. So, and I've been wanting to go back and play it because I honestly don't even really remember other than the woman looking for her sister. And I don't even remember the ending or nothing. And I can't even continue. It's like it didn't even save what happened. I'm sure. I mean, I think it's a horror game. It seemed like it. And I don't remember it being bad, so... The Brilliance of Ada, or Ada. My dear sister, I left you suddenly and without warning. For that, and so much more to come, I apologize. I didn't board the Helios knowing what would happen, only that pursuing my research could change the world. And we did! Just not in the way I'd imagined. Not yet, anyway. I want to explain everything now, so that you'd see that there is nothing to fear. You've always tried to protect me, my big sister, but this was meant to be. It's now my turn to protect you. If only so that things unfold the way they are meant to. Time and necessity has kept us apart, but that is about to change. We need you here aboard the Helios with me. I've enclosed a receiver, and as the name implies, it can receive signals through which we will communicate. I know little of this will make any sense right now, but I also know that you will keep your promise. I love you. Your sister, Ada. Pretty light on details there, Ada. You leave without warning and now need me aboard the Helios? What aren't you telling me? Leave your room, okay? Please wear the official Helios outfit provided by Ward Clifel? I have no idea. It's a little bit blurry. And she's a little bit slow to move. The Helios. The eighth wonder of the world. A triumph of engineering for the advancement of science. Join the Helios crew. Apply at the local Warden Clife office. Okay. I need the sensitivity to go up. Okay. That's about as far as sensitivity is going to go. Okay, British Navy in pursuit of the Helios. Alleged kidnapping of the prominent British mathematician 
has the world on edge. Hand him over, says the Prime Minister. The Prime Minister. Warden Clive denies wrongdoing, claims that Maxwell joined voluntarily. International groups of diplomats rally to claim to calm rising tensions. Conquering new scientific frontiers under the guidance of Nikola Tesla himself. Invent and innovate without artificial limitations of capital and politics. Can't do anything with that one. So it's kind of like Bioshock, in a way. Some people wanting to get, get out from the government hand. So that they can have unlimited, uh, unlimited freedom for scientific advancement. That's what it seems like. The Helios Grand Theater, the best entertainment to stimulate the best to stimulate the best minds. Well, we're certainly out at sea. Oh. What's that over there? Oh, is this not the Helios? Oh, that must be the Helios. Okay. I was about to say, I remember the Helios being a bit, uh, grander than this. Like, bigger and better looking. This seemed a little small. London 03 automated boat. Let's go to the green. Okay, not nothing. Can I take this? That seems like a good thing to have. I wonder, is there a field of view? Rumble, no. Press button to commence docking procedure. Sure. Well, I guess we'll just have a seat. Boy, I just hope I can make it through that one section. Storm in a teacup presents. And I need to check my camera placement. Yeah, there we go. I remember the Helios being massive. A massive ship.
close to the sun. The Helios rail system goes along the length of the ship on both the port and starboard side. It is mainly used to transport personnel from the living districts to the respe respective departments, but it is also used to move equipment. Visitors and new arrivals often lose their perception of where they are aboard the Helios. The Border of Hermes, Chapter 1 All right, off into the fray. Board the Helios and establish communication with Ada. Then I love the whole like Victorian architecture and like steampunk look. Huh. Okay. I was about to say, how do I get off this? Because I don't think I can jump. I the great Helios would be more... busy? I guess Ada didn't tell anyone I was coming. Yep. <laughs> Is that a cow? Okay. Helios, a scientific endeavor that cruises in luxury while the rest of the world is left to fend for itself. Yep, just kind of like Rapture. I can hear it. But where is it? Okay, nothing back here. What in the world? Is it up there? Huh. Seems like I'll have to let myself in. The ship rat. Active spy. Isolate and eliminate. You gonna give me a big presentation? No? Well, God, that actually got me. Okay. Warden Cliff, a company distributing electricity to half of the world and yet still hungers for that other half. Okay, so we're in the very back of the ship. The harbor. Quarantine. Oh, that's fantastic. What have you got yourself into, Ada? Oh, right. goddamn. This is not good for us at all. That's the last word you want to see. I mean, honestly, I think I'd rather see the word monster or beast than quarantine. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. 
It is so quiet. Oh my gosh. Nicholas Passport. Nicholas Ford. October 11th, 1850. It's an actor. 21 days. Okay. So he was here for the entertainment, or as the entertainment. What did I miss? Finally, a game where you can just cross over something simple. In most games, you would not be able to get over that. Oh, finally someone actually thought it through. Just hop over. Damn. What do you keep doing with your hand? Okay. Thought maybe she would try to push him open or something. Disable the... T Oh, but you can't step over the plant. Oh my gosh. Wow. Join him. Hello? Any anyone there? Oh yeah, that's never a good sign at all. Okay. Bathrooms. <laughs> oh, a whole lot of nothing. This does not seem good for us. Hmm. Everything is locked. And I'm not seeing any collect collectibles either. Five connections involved people, Tom, Kate, and John. All documents are available privately. Excelsior Hotel 220. I don't think any of that is information that I need. Okay. Lab researcher from South Korea. Although I think at this point in time, to be perfectly honest, there I don't think there was a North and South Korea. Is that exactly, was that what that said? No, okay, just said Korea. <laughs> so that was my bad, okay, all right. I was just reading too much into that. So I was about to say, in this point in time, there was just a Korea, not a North and South. British Navy in pursuit. I've already read that. Confirmed Edison agents? 
Seems like their rivalry is alive and well. False flag operations. Confirmed Edison agents. Oh boy. Incident KA812. In accordance to procedure protocol A12, officers greeted the shuttle from Sydney upon arrival. When the, when the guest did not appear as instructed, the officers embarked the shuttle to perform standard search. The guest was not found aboard and neither was any of the issued Warden Cliff paperwork or issued clothing. Further inspection of the vehicle revealed a noticeable but harmless indention on the starboard side of the shuttle. There was no record of this dent when the vessel left Sydney, so it is possible that the shuttle was boarded by another ship while en route to the Helios. This is the 11th incident of similar nature this year alone. The vulnerable nature of the automated shuttles has to be corrected. The ID documentation and Warden Cliff uniforms that are regularly lost could provide Edison with enough information to create convincing forgeries. I have yet to receive any reassurance that measures are being taken to prevent these incidences from reoccurring. Security Officer DeRossi or DeRossi. Okay, so what is this? Okay, so we're just going to brute force this. Well, okay, I did not need to brute force it, brute force it that much. All right. Okay, one more to go. Okay, there's one. Profile, profile armless, suspected sleeper agent, find confirming or eliminating evidence. Patel, lab, lab technician. Okay, that startled me a little bit. I was not expecting that. <clears throat> okay, before I do that and trigger something, let's look around. You know, and just so you know, I am playing on the Nintendo Switch. Because that's what I bought this on originally. So if you're playing on, like, Xbox, PlayStation, PC, the graphics are probably going to be a lot better than this. So just a fair warning. Okay. Blood. Okay, art ex art expedition. Ugh. Cockroaches. Nikola Tesla rescues British intelligence officer to oversee information security or recruits British intelligence officer to oversee information security aboard the Helios. Yet another high-profile scientist joins the ever-growing Helios crew. Sabotage attempt averted as Helios shuttle avoids ramming. Suspect in the brig. Jackpot. Infosec just sent a tube that cor corroborates the dates and places. He's an Edison spy, alright. Your gut instinct was right again. It's important that we 
make this one count. We need to tap him on all that he knows, whether he wants us to sing or not. This is definitely a West-West situation. Feel free to get creative. I think that meant this is definitely a Wild West situation. I think is what that meant to say. I'm not sure what the whole mask is about. Okay. Guess just brute force it. get interrogated aboard the Helios Ugh. wait until my editor hears about this I'd be more concerned about yourself because if you're caught you're gonna end up in that chair you know you seem to have a lack of self preservation right now Tube message, don't worry. Her research her research holds the key to everything. Okay. Cryptic. Who is this message for? I can't well, I can't climb that. Bit slow of a climber. David Bishop. And he looked to be a child, too. Tesla's death ray to make war impossible. Nikola Tesla proposes to compel the world towards peace with the threat of immeasurable damage. His newly announced weaponry is about to go up for auction. It has nations all over the world scrambling for funds. Nikola te Nikola's ship, mounted weaponry, weaponry, could annihilate an entire fleet. That's it. That was all that was up here. But yeah, I would love to have played this on my PC. But just buying the game again. I can't do that right now. Like there's I've been wanting to play Alien Isolation. And I've really been debating about whether I should buy it for my PC or just play it again on the Switch. Um unfortunately I think I'm gonna have to play it on the Switch. The graphics aren't that bad. They're still good. They're just not as great as what it could be. All right. The interrogation of research Becker has an immediate effect on the amount of cross-department chatter that contains sensitive information. Unfortunately, it has also made the sus suspected Edison leak go silent. We are therefore further along in our investigation over exactly what material has been compromised. We are no further along in our investigation over what material has been compromised. It is, I am hereby requesting that a more hands-on approach be taken in order to assure the continued security of the Helios. We cannot afford another grand-scale sabotage. Once it is enough, I am aware of how uncomfortable Mr. T is with, the, with these less sophisticated measures, but doing it the old-fashioned way is sometimes the only option. Officer Strutman. As Edison denies espionage allegations, 
Accusations are merely circumstantial, claims Edison. Preparations for a countersuit is on its way. Wardenclyffe denies the comment. Tesla absent as preliminary hearings commence into accusations of Edison espionage. French climatologist Jean Valprix, I don't know French, seen boarding shuttle vessel to the Helios. Yet another high profile scientist joins the crew. Sabotage attempt averted as Helios shuttle avoids ramming. Okay. I am not seeing any collectibles. That should do it. Now to find Ada. Take the elevator to the higher floor to reestablish communication with Ada. Vapor. Incoming threat. Known alias is Matthias Ellis. Simone Alder or Simon Alder. Ernest Hempson. Hmm. Okay, we'll need to go back out this way. Sorry, my allergies have been acting up really bad. A worn key card used for the Helios entrance elevator. Ooh, damn. Yeah, just knowing someone was lurking around. When in danger, run. Those who have tried to stay in fight have all died. Chapter 2, The Fire of Prometheus. Yeah, this so much in a way reminds me of Bioshock. You are here. <clears throat> Ooh, so pretty. Yeah, that that is really cool looking. Can I get some help? I need some help. No. Well, darn. Gotta make this so difficult. Uh, the Helios. Named 
after the sun itself, a source of almost unlimited power. This is a safe space for those with an open mind and a talent for the scientific arts to expand the limits of human endeavor. Away from prying eyes and cynical money men, here all that matters is progress as we reach for the very stars themselves. It is our floating home and the cradle of mankind's technological evolution. You walk within the very future of the human race, and you are most, most welcome. <clears throat> yep, definitely rapture. Most definitely. Hmm. I don't even know what a collectible looks like. I don't even remember. The earthquake machine brings down city block. Seven killed and many injured as buildings came falling down. Misguided experiment creates damage at Wide Cliff Warehouse Quarter. Promises of compensation and rebu rebuilding efforts arrive from Warden Cliff after a disastrous test of new invention. Tesla coil. The neon light. Tesla Tower. My first Tesla Tower at Warden Cliff was a huge success. I always knew that my dream of free energy transmitted wirelessly across the globe would be a resounding success. What I did not foresee was the hunger of the human race. It's gluttony for more, more, and more electricity. Wireless transmission of power, that's the easy part. Finding that power in the first place, now there's the tricky. You know, and what's funny is, he did build the tower, and he was successful in transmitting electricity through the air. Uh, Nikola Tesla is one of my favorite scientists. When I discovered the x-ray, we had a wonderful time in the lab shooting each other with the thing. Blackened silhouettes on the walls capturing a single moment of playtime for all eternity. That, of course, until we realize that x-rays are quite, quite harmful. This machine makes the whole process much safer, though far less fun. Yeah, I don't know why the audio was broke there. Radio waves aren't just great for transmitting sound, images, and energy across large distances, but with this radio Here on the Helios, then you've already enjoyed a voyage on one of these. They are unmanned vessels, controlled automatically via radio signals. Less risky in case of malfunction and subsequent drowning. Not that there was ever much risk. That is to say, you're safely here, aren't you? So, all's well. This is the machine with which I intend to rid the world of war. Once and for all, my dear Death Ray, it may seem contradictory that such a thing could promote peace, but possessed with this, none would even consider military action against us. That's the theory, at least. Yeah, but the only problem is when both sides have a Death Ray, then it becomes a problem. And there's the earthquake machine. Uh, Warden Cliff announces success. Resonance with other dimension. Only Tesla knows how it works. Dawn of free energy. Is Tesla violating the laws of conservation of energy? Free energy threatens thousands of energy jobs. Riots expected. Hmm. 
Yeah, if you've ever dealt into like the history of Nikola Tesla, it was it's quite fascinating. And he did a lot of secret work, which I think the government uh, came in and took like a bunch of his research. I don't know. It was very. You could very quickly. Full of scientists in the middle of the ocean. What could possibly go wrong? Like, there's a whole rabbit hole you can go down with whole Nikola Tesla and his inventions. <laughs> right? Uh -huh. Anyone? We're all just wearing masks? What the hell is that? Yeah, I can hear you, but what the hell am I doing here? If you didn't write the letter, who did? It's in your handwriting and everything. This is gonna sound weird, but it might have been me. Not present me, but future me. I know how crazy that sounds, but I promise I can explain everything. Let's rendezvous in my apartment. From there, we'll escape together, okay? Escape from what, exactly? It's not safe here, Rose. It's spreading throughout the ship. I'll tell you everything when we meet up in my apartment. You need to grab a Faraday keycard from the check-in desk there in the main hall. They're kept in a wall-mounted safe. The combination should be written down somewhere nearby. The keycard will automatically take the elevator to the right district. Did you get all that? Yeah. Open safe. Get keycard. Use elevator. Meet in your apartment. I, I got it. Great. I won't be able to reach you on the radio for a bit, so just get there and stay safe, okay? Fine. But when you get there, I'm expecting some answers. Deal? Deal. Oh, and sis, even if I can't explain why or how you got here, I really am grateful that you're here. See you soon. See you soon, sis. WeatherTech. An engraving on the inside reads WeatherTech Anonymity? Anonymity mask? Return to Warden Cliff representative hmm. yeah, I would say whatever free energy Nikola Tesla created this is like a nasty side effect bio labs so I'm guessing did everyone aboard the ship wear a mask to conceal their identity I mean, they're not very good masks for actually concealing your identity, to be perfectly honest. Tech Labs. Okay, so this is the bar. Ship security. Wow. I have to say that is the weirdest looking mask. I've already read that one.
You can hop over a table, but you can't step over a fallen plant. That must be the safe. Now to get it open. One, four, two. Eric, remember, remember to write down the new safe code when you change it. Margaret had to come all the way from the tech labs just to reset the safe mechanism last week. She wasn't pleased. Okay. Um, this is odd setup. Okay, so this should be two, this should be four, and that's one, okay. Bingo. Sweet. A key card for the elevator. got startled by the birds okay all right hope this works not good when there's a bloody handprint Ada Archer Younger sister to Rose Archer, a brilliant theological physicist. Her research aboard the Helios proved the one electron theory. Oh, I couldn't even read the rest of it. Nikola Tesla, an inventor, entrepreneur, and the richest man alive. His company, Wardenclyffe, provides wireless electricity from stations all over the globe. Uh uh uh. One electron theory opening the door to free and limitless energy. The Department of Security monitors all, push, all personnel aboard the Helios to protect it from sabotage. Uh, evidence point that Edison, blah, blah, blah. Chapter 3, Home of the Esti Estia. Ugh. What is that smell? Enter the apartment complex. Check the security or reception desk. Some bored employee left the sketch of Tesla behind. Hmm. I don't really get it, but whatever. Newly opened Wardenclyffe operations in South America reignites tensions. Edison threatens to resume legal actions against Wardenclyffe's expansion. International court complexes complications could delay power grid growth. Excellent, we're not alone. I mean, we've already known that, but... Wow, way to call her fat. What? Wow. Oh my God. What's going on? You're in pieces, Ada. Shit. Get me out. How do I get out? Rose. Rose. It's gonna be okay. Rose, listen to me. You're 
having a panic attack. Just focus on my voice, Rose. Close your eyes and just focus on my voice. Breathe with me. One leaf in. One thorn out. One leaf in. One thorn out. Butchered, Ada. Who or what did this? We don't we don't know yet. But right now we need to get you safe. Make your way to the center of the apartment complex. There's a generator that will open the gates. Focus on that for now. I'm on my way. I'll broadcast you again shortly. Be careful, sis. I'll try. I was about to say there was this other door. Damn, when she fell, she really panicked. To go all the way over here from the door? I mean, damn. <clears throat> then can she... She can't walk over the bodies. And I've not found a single collectible yet. It said every chapter had a collectible. And I mean, I'm looking around... So I don't understand why I'm not finding anything. Unless maybe it saved my progress from the previous playthrough and it's not showing the collectibles because I already collected them. Maybe. I don't know. Service. There's the laundry schedule. Oh, you're a quick one. Wow, this lag. Visions from the past. That must be it. Let's see about getting some lights on in here. Okay. Step one. Okay, green light. Enter the code one one Z one three or is that one one two one three? <laughs> okay. Two one three okay who Ada Ugh, about damn time what took you <coughs> hello who is this? If you've harmed my sister, I swear to God I will break oh, every hey, bone. Hey, hey. I haven't harmed anyone, all right? My name's Aubrey, and it's really, really nice to finally talk to someone who isn't decomposing, you know? Uh... Never mind, sorry. But you have got to get me out of here. I'm holed up in the engine halls, starboard side, deck 82. 
kind of trapped, actually. How soon can you get here? Look, buddy, I can't make any promises. I'm going to get my sister off this thing, but if we can, we will come to get you too. How does that sound? Oh yeah, of course. Don't mind me. I'll just sit here and starve. No problem. That sounds great. You know, Benny here at the corner died due to an exotic energy leak, but he still has most of his spine intact. Maybe he can lend it to you so that the next time a person in need asks for help, you will have enough of a backbone to actually do something. Ah. What the hell was all that about? <laughs> Get lost, dude. Yeah, I would leave that dude behind. I'd be like, screw you, dude. <clears throat> All right. Maxwell District, the Faraday District. Is anyone still alive in Faraday? We need help. We're trapped in the Maxwell with a severe exo-leak. We've tried to close it off, but it just keeps spreading. Some are hallucinating shapes in the exo-clouds, and it's just putting everyone on edge. We haven't heard from sec departments, so quarantine protocol is still active. But people are considering making a break for the rail tunnels. Send someone, anyone. I'm not seeing her name. I kind of remember this section because it was a very big area and I think it took me a while to find what I was looking for. To whoever is repeatedly stealing the toilet paper deliveries, help you die of rectal hemorrhaging. Uh, a toilet paper <clears throat> Uh, slash marks. Spain withholds supply shipment to the Helios. Invention dispute escalates as the negotiations, negotiations come to an abrupt halt. The international exhibit in Brussels opens to roaring crowds. Edison announces new infrastructure investments all across Southeast Asia. It's just laggy out in this big open area. I'm trying to read the names. It's a bit laggy in this big open area. Aaron Prosper with wife Maria or Marie and sons Humphrey and Benjamin. 
Hey Dad, this is a photo we took before we went aboard. We're looking forward to seeing new stories on your return. Mom says hello. Okay. That was it. Service. Uh, it is not fair. We in the biology department come back with clothes either covered in blood or dirt, while the mo while the worst physicist department ever gets in some light. Ever gets is some light chalk stains from writing equations all day. We need t at least two laundry da laundry days to get the blood stains out. Hmm. Still not a single collectible. Archer Ada. Aha! Alpha Quarter. Now I just need to find a way inside. Oh, you gotta be joking. I remember this. It took freaking forever to find what I needed to get in here. Because I need a, a specific card. Listen, buddy. Like I said before, we will Rose? do what we can. Who are you talking to? Ada. Oh, thank God. Yeah, some guy named Aubrey was broadcasting on a frequency. Said he was stuck in the engine halls and mentioned something about... Exotic energy? I'd like some answers. Rose, I'd rather explain it in person. It's no, not Ada, what now you is a great time to tell me what the hell is going on here. Fine, fine. I'll be brief. Listen, we discovered quantum resonance anomalies that prove the one electron theory, meaning that every electron in the universe is the same one moving back and forth through time. So naturally, we began to consider a second time dimension attached to the Euclidean analogy of Minkowski space. Now, I know Ada. what you're thinking. Ada. What about the Thomson conjecture? Ada. Well, Ada. that's... Ada, 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 stop. It's me you're talking to. None of that nerd talk. Right. Uh, okay. A large experiment went boom. It ruptured a current of time and dangerous things have flooded through it. These things have been killing us. All of us. We've tried to contain it all, but... Point is, we need to leave. Did you find my apartment? Yeah, but the Alpha Quarter is locked. I can't get in. <coughs> Don't suppose you keep a spare keycard somewhere. Shit. No, wait! Yes, I do! My friend Eliza has a pair. God, I, I hope she's okay. She's on the ground floor, Gamma Quarter. Gamma? Then her entrance is covered in a web of live electricity cables. I can't get near it. Can you turn off the power source? The override code should be written in the Epsilon guest quarter. Easy peasy. Right. I will get the override code and disable the generator. Easy peasy. Listen, I'm entering another shielded section, so I'll lose my broadcast ability again. But I'll try to hurry. I'm getting closer. Okay. So we need to go to Epsilon quarter and then Gamma quarter. I guess... This is Sigma. Okay, so I need to go to Epsilon and then Gamma. 
Okay, so I need to go to Epsilon to turn off the generator to get into Gamma. Zeta. Lambda. Or Lambda. Ugh. Epsilon. Was this open before? I don't think this was. Okay, so triangle and triangle with that. The obnoxious, obnoxiously curious 18 year old who visited last week, Albert, left his belongings in the wind guest suite. Could you get in touch with our German Wardenclyffe office in order to arrange to return the return shipping of his things? Thanks, Marta. P.S. We've received a special request for a piano to be brought to the Earth Suite. See if you can get maintenance to get out, to help out with transportation from the docks. Okay. Alright, I'm going to end it for right here, because I remember this section, this little chapter, was very long, if I remember correctly, because it's a lot of exploring lots of different rooms. So, we'll pick it up next time exploring the residences. So thanks for joining me and I will see you next time.